My name is uh, Yogi Palacios. I'm 29 years old. I'm from Puerto Rico and I got four kids, three girls and one boy. I would never thought that getting checked up for my pregnancy, I was going to find out that I had a lump on my uh, left side. And that's when everything started in that, in 2012. I was okay. I was really good. After that, I felt that I was complete. I was done in my chapter. I was, I was ready to start the living and not worry about my health. February of 2018, I went back again to do my annual checkup. I went and I did it, but I never went back to get the result or consult, nothing. I'm, I'm happy, I don't want it. I don't want to, everything is okay. I'm not gonna worry about it. It's, it's all good. It seems like you, your cancer is back. I couldn't, no, no way. This is done, no. I already had it once, I cannot have it twice. My heart dropped. The only thing, she was just talking and talking, well, we're gonna do this and that, but I didn't remember none of those words because for some reason I feel my ear went mute. And all I remember and all I hear in my head, it was the cancer is back. The cancer is back. In July 22nd, I should be celebrating that I was cancer free. And I'm not, I told my husband. The next day, it was a Friday. I feel like I have cancer and it's back. And it's in phase three. And I got t t 10 tumors. I got four on my breast and seven on the side. He just said, we got this. I'm here for you. You're not alone. I wasn't ready and I think nobody will get ready until you're in that step. Taking the breast out, it, was gonna, it wasn't gonna be the same. I wasn't gonna be the same. I decided to take the surgery. I decided to have a mastectomy and I don't want, I don't want no reconstruction or nothing because I just wanna be done. And this is my second chance of life. God giving me a second life. Not the good way, but it's the best because I'm blessed. To see the bright shirt, you see that that's another survivor or that's another woman going through the process. Encourage you that you're not, literally, you're not alone. What I see every time is that I'm always the youngest. And I'm like, if they did it, I can do it. They're a little bit older than me and they have so strength. They have so encouraged to do it. And I'm like, I have, this is me, I have to do it. 